Okay, today it's time to play the new game which has been released, Control. First of all, I always before uh, play the game, I always check the config to see our the uh, display and the graphics are really so high or not. So, full control audio display are on the highest. Okay. Oh no. Go to the high. Okay. Go for new game speakers. Of course, text language, audio language, subtitle. Actually, uh, both of us we need. So let's increase a little the brightness and start the new game. This is actually one of the newest game which has been released recently. So I also have the uh, game which has been uh, promoted on uh, actually. This is gonna be weirder than usual. Forget it. Can't Let's be just get to the game. You called me, so here I am. I have no fucking clue what are the characters, how are the characters, what the story is about. I have no fucking clue. I know I shut you out sometimes. But it started mysteriously. I like I'm it. always glad to hear from you. It's just that I get my hopes up. So many times it's led to nothing. I found nothing. It's like we live in a room and there's a poster on the wall. The wall poster. We stare at it and we think that's the whole world. The room and the poster. It must be a picture game. Nice. A landscape, a famous it person. It's creepy. Like in that movie, what is it called? The prison movie. The prison movie. Oh my god, that's very good. The great. room's a cell, and the picture, it's different for each of us. It can be beautiful or terrible, but we're all transfixed. But it's all a lie. It's something to distract us from the truth. They're lying to us. Definitely. We're lying to ourselves. The room's not the world. The world is much bigger and much stranger. There's a hole hidden behind that poster that leads to the real world. What world? What we all world feel we safe about? in that room. But sometimes, sometimes something crawls out from behind the poster. And the ones that see it happen freak out and try to forget what they saw. Okay. I'm here. Oh my god. Seems like it has seriously high graphics. Which my system is not handling it. Hello? Let's check the display to put it on. Medium. Anyone here? Not really. Display, let's go for the low. Medium. And also medium. Let's try the low ones. That's way better. Actually, it seems like my computer is not really that powerful to play the game on high graphics. So, what are we supposed to do? Are we looking for a poster? 
is it an open world game or something? I mean, I'm still trying to process to figure this game out. So I'm just checking out the config. Uh, nothing here. Nothing also here. Okay, let's go upstairs. This seal. I saw it a long time ago. I keep seeing it in my dreams. Okay. Collectibles. Assets. Clearance level. Collectibles. Federal Bureau of Control. Okay, really type of these collectibles. While running to sprint. How to hold the doors opens Federal automatically. Of control. All these years I've been looking for them and they were hiding in plain sight. Let's crouch. Are we supposed to crouch? Have a crouch? Security collectibles, currents, on security order, a shark in here, all the permission, shoot to kill. So, all classified. All top class. Just collecting, just collecting everything. What? I mean, I'm not seeing it clearly. Let's go to the display and increase the brightness. Nothing has changed. Forget it. Sorry if I just change the config too much. I just want to have the best experience of this game. Who's there? Who is here? Job. Janitor's assistant. You need to go to the interview. Go that way to the elevator. Thanks. Elevator that way. Got it. Very good. I'm Ahti. The janitor, by the way. You work for me. It looks creepy. You can say I sent you. If they don't hire you, they tell you you have a hell of it. There be work for the axe. Take them behind the sauna, you hot. What? I've done the heck are you talking, talking about? To know it makes us come off weird. Naughty the janitor is a friendly face in my book. Better than somebody with no face at all. <laughs> Think about it. No face. To the elevator. Okay. The cell. Boom. And the poster. See deeper into the I was 11 okay. years old the first time I saw behind the poster. They told me I imagined it. I've been trying to pull it down ever since. Will you help? Definitely. I mean, I will do my best. Who are these people? What is this game about? I have still no clue. We are just 
came into a mysterious place we are looking for mysterious people she's going into a job interview I mean still don't get it Control is. Did I lose you there for me. a moment? Sorry about that. You know what's on my mind. My baby brother, Dylan. Seventeen years since the men of this bureau took him. Let's shut this alarm off. Collectibles, more collectible. Nothing here. Okay, one here. In the director's office. What is it? Is it the director's office? Shit. Holy. F shit. shit Molly. What the hell just happened? Why did up? the guy the just shoot weapon? in the face? Really? Oh, I'm not, I'm not supposed to touch anything. And there goes the poster. Objects of power can cause or be results of AWE's altered world events, intrusions upon the perceived reality. Now, the service weapon is, of course, a prime example of an OOP, a very powerful one. Ingrained in the Bureau's DNA, a key component in our prime candidate program. Come out of that Russian roulette a winner and you, <laughs> you're it. Where am I? I mean, did I just teleport it into a different place? Okay, so seems like it's just instructions to learn how to play the game. What? Holy! Shit! What kind of a power is that? The same gun. What are you going to do with the gun? Mm -hmm. Oh, the recharging is also weird. The recharging is also seriously Oh, is it the creepiest horror 
game or like an action? I don't get it. Here it comes more. Oh, 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 easy, buddy, easy, easy. I'm not the enemy. Pyramid spoke to me, and it was just noise, and I understood every word. Is it because of the guns alive? Oh, you know what? I'm happy. Happy to be here. You're happy to be here, so you wanted to be here. Things have quieted down outside. Is it safe to go? Oh. Oh my god. What is happening? What's happening to me? You can't let this happen. 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 You stopped it. You who stop it? Who are you, whom are you talking to? Horror. Get the fuck away! Holy shit. Just suddenly, everything just started suddenly. I mean, whom am I killing? Why, why am I killing? Why do I have to kill? Secure line of communication. Says the dead man. Okay, man, you got me. Holy. Shit. But seriously, I'm liking this game. Proceed further into the Baru. Okay, let's just go further. Dinner reservations. How are they floating into the air? sound that tried to invade me earlier the hiss burrowing into everything in this place is the hiss rocket buddy all right it's our enemy what and who's the enemy I mean. that babbles contagious it burrows in like an infuriating melody that makes you hum it over and over
Is it like a ritual or ceremony or something? Oh shit! I was going for the melee. What? Shelter. Max occupancy six persons. Open it again. Hissing sound that tried to invade me earlier. The hiss burrowing into everything in this place. Is the hiss you All right. Die, die! You son of a bitch! Holy shit. This game's awesome! Cleanse the control point. Cleanse the control me? point. Help me fix it. Outfit. Can we change our outfit? With the bureau. Oh. Is a civilian? I like this. Fast travel. Fast travel to Where are we? Central ex executive. So forget it. Me. We saw you deal with the compromised agents. I can't tell you how happy I am to talk to somebody sane. The feeling's mutual. Yeah, I'm Pope, Emily Pope, Dr. Darling's assistant. My turn. Should I lie? Jesse Faden. I'm just visiting. I should have lied. Huh? Shit! You're the new director. Hold on! We're coming out! Director... Phaeton. Call me Jesse. Okay, Jesse. I'm Emily. Look, somehow, this hostile force, this... Hiss? That works? Somehow the Hiss managed to infiltrate the building without any warning. And just like that, my name for it is official. The Hiss. Like the sound of poison gas leaking in. We're in full lockdown. It seems to have spread everywhere and to everyone not protected by an HRA. And, extraordinarily, you. You are the director, and that makes you special by definition. Trench is no longer the director, obviously. Uh, I'm sorry, I'm talking too much. This whole situation is just a lot. 
Trench is dead. Shot. Ah. I found his body. And the gun. Do I tell her it looked like a suicide? The service weapon. Also, and this can sound crazy, but he keeps appearing to me, saying things. It's hard to make out, but he told me to cleanse the control point, push the hiss out. The whole room shifted around. You did that? And you entered the building when it was already in the lockdown before you became the new director? How? Maybe I'm, I'm the special on the chosen. Yet. A janitor let me in. <laughs> I love it. This is fucking unbelievable. It's... I can't even... Ugh, look, Jesse, I have a million questions and you probably have a million more. Like, do you know my brother Dylan? Not yet. But there's something I need to ask you to do first. If you can cleanse a control point, then you can maybe cure those infected or possessed by the Hiss. Because if that's possible, our options are very different. Emily Pope. I don't know her, but I like her already. She's the opposite of the faceless agency I blame for what happened. So in this Hiss, this Hiss, uh, have you seen this movie, yet. The Blindfold? Or rather, the bureau. Actually, that's a very good movie. I mean, yeah. it's like something very similar to that movie. So it's like a hiss. I'm you cannot for see you, it. Of course. Uh, so whoever sees it, it just die. You just can't feel it or something. It lives inside you. Okay. So we have to you cleanse these infected people. Push the hiss out. Ripping it out rips them apart. Jesse, over here. Emily, where are you? I can't cleanse them. I saw. It was worth a shot. Thank you, Director. Jesse. Cleanse them of what? Of this hiss. But what is this hiss? Why I'm here. I'll risk it. Listen, the Bureau was involved in an incident in my hometown, Ordinary, 17 years ago. The Bureau came in and covered the whole thing up. I've been looking for this place for a long time. That's enough. Maybe that's too much already. I can't tell her about Dylan and the rest yet. I've seen mentions of an altered world event case dealing with Ordinary. You were at Ground Zero as a child? It was one of the big ones, and before my time. And very classified. I can try to dig out some old files for you. My boss, Casper Darling, would know, but he's missing. I think he knew this was coming, or suspected. He came up with the HRAs, the Hedron Resonance Amplifiers. I think they're what saved us. A few of us. And Director Trench would know. Trench. The ghost. ghost or whatever he is. He mentioned something called the hotline. Said I should find it. It's another object of power, like the gun. An old Bakelite telephone. A direct line of communication between the director and the board. Maybe he can talk to you more clearly through that. I mean, Trench has years and years of experience. He might know how to destroy the hiss. So according Where is the to hotline? these two people, his in the communications department through the mail thing room. has it's happened the before. Sector, so we can access it even with the lockdown in place. We'll get the door open for you. Okay. It's like That's a phenomena or something that has happened That's before, Tomasi's and they department. had been head of researching, setting on this. I don't this. think he had an HRA. He kind of made a point about not wearing one earlier. 
Keep an eye out. They call me the director. But that's not me. I'm not a director type. Not the leader. leader. Be Why being am a I leader here? brings a lot of responsibilities. I think you already know. Yes, I came for my brother, but there are other reasons too. I said I was looking for answers, but I might never understand them. I'm not looking for proof. This is already it. More than enough. No matter what they told me all those years, I know it's real now. I didn't imagine this. I want to be a part of this world. What scares me shitless is that I finally found it. Only to see the hiss destroy it all. What kind of a telephone was that? I know this is all new to you, so don't hesitate to ask me anything you want to know. There are... The hotline should be in the communications department. Uh, origin of the hiss. Where did the hiss come from? I'm not sure. You said the hiss was here when you entered. Did you see anything like that outside before you came in? No. No, just inside. The source is internal, then. See, the oldest house is a sprawling complex with openings to other places as well. I don't even know where to start looking. But in the context, it's good news. The lockdown holds. The hiss escaping the building would be the end. Pretty shitty world out there if you ask me, but I wouldn't want the hiss to destroy it. I'm with you on that, Emily. The oldest house. You mentioned the oldest house. What is it? This building, the bureau headquarters, the oldest house, is a shifting place. Uh, you've seen it. It transcends its physical limits. I've been to New York a few times. How didn't I notice this place? It's an attribute of the building. This is a place of power. The oldest house doesn't like attention, so unless you're purposely trying to find it, you don't. Which is perfect for us. The work we do here is essential, but unstable. The Bureau prefers not to be noticed. And we need strong walls to make sure nothing gets out. So without you, I never would have found the front door. Okay. Mm-hmm. Director Trench. This Trench guy. I keep hearing him in my head. Is he a ghost? Haunting me? I doubt we're talking about a ghost in the traditional sense. But an echo, maybe. See, if he was killed by the service weapon, your gun, maybe it's his final thoughts recorded by the bullet in his brain, like a, a deep space probe sending back data. But that's just a hypothesis on my part. I'd need the gun to research it. But you better hold on to that, given the circumstances. I think I will. Yeah. Objects of... Can you tell me what an object of power is exactly? This is all... Well, new to me. <laughs> Don't worry, I love going over the basics. So objects of power are mundane objects that house paranatural energies and have developed a link to the astral plane and can thus be controlled, which is what differentiates them from altered items, which are still housings of paranatural forces, but are more volatile and cannot be bound in the peri-utilitarian sense. Got it? Did she memorize this? <laughs> Got it. Thanks. I really got it. So HRA stop you from becoming Hiss? Well, it seems that way. I mean, I hadn't even heard of an HRA until a few weeks ago when Dr. Darling started handing them out. Well, I began analyzing mine as soon as I got it. I mean, each one seems to emit a powerful short-range frequency way beyond anything I've ever seen. Doesn't the timing seem suspicious? I thought that too. Dr. Darling usually likes to unveil his latest breakthrough in big presentations. With these, he just passed them out. Yeah, his behavior makes me wonder what exactly he knew. 
Okay, that's enough for me for now. Thanks, Emily. I'm sure I'll have more questions soon. Just well, let me know. We will. So, enter the communication department. Where is the communication department? This is his. See? It tells us where to go and where not to go. There it is again. A welcome message. Who killed this poor person? More of these haunted people. This, do you see the smoke? like some data recorded data log come on man is that a bulletproof vest Buddy. Are each one are you shooting a What the hell is wrong with you people? You're killing a girl. Cleans the place again. Oh, fast travel. See, you can easily fast travel different different places. Does the hiss open the door? Open the door for me? Just look at it. Eight inches wide and capable of storing a whopping 80 kilobytes. <laughs> Stolen by our friends at the CIA, the disk held the launch codes to Soviet nukes. 
Uh, this is not the disc, of course, but one exactly like it. A perfect fusion of concepts vibrating in the Cold War era collective unconscious. A receptacle. It is a receptacle for dangerous energies to hone in on. And they did. We don't have the details, but when things started flying around the disc, it was transferred to us. It's an object of power. Oh, OP. Oops. Oh, and it can launch things telekinetically through the air. Uh, to date, we, we've launched maybe three dozen pencils. And once, we even launched a cup. Creepy. Still not changing my mind about this game being creepy. Ho 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 That's freaking cool. Shield. Come on, man, no more with the shields. Cover. We just have to get rid of the shelf. The rest, easy peasy. What the hell? Where am I supposed to go?
not opening. So, you have to get to another place. Communications are on the right track. Okay, guess I'm the right track. Hey, show yourself. Object of power. Looks like the hiss flashed on the We need to find it. That one is a dead end. This one's the restroom. Unfortunately, you just have to go to the same Cursed doomed room. He's shooting me. to hear you when I'm here. It's like that channel's been changed. The board's in charge here. Their pyramids in the bureau seal. Are they really the ones pulling the strings? I'm not their director. I'm no one's director. Oh. Holy sweet mother of nature.
this game is awesome. Bound deliver. Ooh, that's a new power. S supernatural power. There you are. You were gone. Cut off. I got it. I'm fucking psycho, do not mess with me. That's freaking awesome! Emily said that the hotline can be reached through the mail room. Now over two. That's the first question. This must open the door. Clearance level one. Okay. Now I got the control of this part. Do not mess with me. You're listening to America Is it the real hiss or something? Great.
Oh shit! I still have to understand, be able to deal with the config, with the gameplay. Oh, this hiss is a son of a bitch. That's a big one. They can fly now. Great. Holy shit, I just... Shit! Shit! Damn it, this gameplay is. I mean, you just have the possibility of being hit two times, that's it, and you're dead. What are you? I have a feeling he'll be back. Well, Let's stay focused. Of course the he'll be back. Should be past yeah. Still, the we don't know. It's a she or a he. All right, take this down. The situation in Cuba has been evaluated by the relevant authorities. The mysterious illness affecting the staff at the U.S. Embassy in Havana was caused by sonic weaponry in the hands of a foreign power.
numerous personnel. Alberto Tomasi, head of comms. Are expected to make a full recovery. The hiss got him. The also damaged their cellular walls, but we can't blame that on the hotline can't be far now. <sighs> hotline chamber. There we go. a lot of roadside motels across the country on the road on the run under the radar this feels like all of them like something recognized from a dream well every time you just ring the spell one of the doors opens See? Still nothing. The key has a black pyramid on it. Black pyramid, black pyramid, black pyramid here. I guess I got it. Black Pyramid. Oh, we are just teleporting back. I'm still trying to process the game. Astro <laughs> Plane Challenge. Let's see what kind of a new power we are going to get. Oh, the hotline will allow you to contact experimental entities. I'm dead again. Okay. So we have to figure this out, figure what to do next. There is no double jump.
It is a phone. It's an object of power. It doesn't connect to any typical network. A direct line to the astral plane and the board. And my hypothesis is, under the right conditions to other planes of existence as well. Oh. A director needs a team, my management team. These people know the secrets of the Bureau as well as I do. Some even better. Darling, Tomasi, Salvador, Marshall. Marshall especially, my head of operations. She sees right through me. She knows I don't like relying on people. The only person you should fail is yourself. But things change when you become director. Oh! She's bleeding. I have it. The hotline. I can reach Trench. Well, listen to him. He feels more like an echo. An echo with important info. I need to get back to Emily. So, we will get back to Emily, let's have a short break, will react and strongly we will start the part tell them two, you. actually. Is it too soon to tell Emily? She might be able to help, 